the universal way of oneness, the way of equality, part two. Living the way of equality allows you to show up in your divine power in all situations, no matter what. Even if you're protesting against an acted out injustice, you now come from peace and power, not rage, hate, and resentment, because that's not powerful. That's weakness. Hating those that hate you makes you hateful, just like them. You are now, you are in fact no different than those that hate you. Let that sink in. As a woman, if you hate men because of the tremendous sexism and misogyny that still, it, that still exists in the world today, you are lowering yourself to the level of those that participate in those ugly, chauvinistic behavior programs. Instead, learn what it means to powerfully stand up to those men who have such low self-worth, because that is what they have. And be sure to love and honor the men who live in the truth that both men and women are equal and are one. Powerful divine women don't make the men who act out the weakness of sexist superiority programs inferior to them so they can feel a false sense of superiority. That's exactly what they do, isn't it? Why would you lower yourself to the status that they choose to live by? Instead, simply live in the way of equality and speak out when injustices are directed at you or when you witness it happening to other women. It's no different for a person of color who has experienced racism. If you hate all whites, then you are no better than any white supremacist. Pause so that you can comprehend what I just stated to you. In fact, you are a mirror image of them. If you create a social media group that clearly states no whites allowed, then you are no different from the racists that fought so hard for segregation to continue. Trying to be superior to white people in order to heal your wounds of inferiority will never work. And what's worse, you're running the very same hate and separation programs that racist white people have run for centuries. We don't excuse child molesters just because the offenders were once molested as children. They don't get a pass from being an abuser because they were abused. We expect them to rise up to heal their traumas and woundedness and break the cycles of abuse by doing the hard work to self-heal, preventing them from ever turning around and harming a child the same way that they were harmed when they were children. And this is exactly what all women, all minorities, and people who have been oppressed or victimized must learn how to do. Simply put, stop lowering yourselves to the vibrational frequencies, to the behaviors, to all of the ways in which people who really are oppressors, racists, misogynists, stop lowering yourselves to their level. Have you not learned that that's not how we should show up in the world? By you simply showing up and doing it back makes you just as fucking asshole, harmful violators like they are. Let it sink in and stop lowering yourself. And when I say lowering yourself, don't look at them that they are inferior. They are in a different grade. What they do is detestable, so why are you behaving like them? You think you're better because you behave just like them? Let it sink in. It's time to heal ourselves. It's time to grow up. And it's time to stop allowing us to be brainwashed by the motherfucking elites who control the puppet strings when we are the puppets, hating each other, acting out all of these things like stupid, ignorant, blind little fools. It's time to wake up for real because when we do and we function as the vibrational frequency of the way of equality, those cult leaders, those lunatics, those psychopaths that create things like inequality and racism so we act it all out with each other, they all cease to exist because they cannot continue to live and vibrate at the frequency that they do when we have chosen to rise, unite together in oneness, because what we do is dissolve and heal all of those lower vibrational frequencies on the earth. We all have the power to do that. What the fuck are you waiting for? Let's go.